Bad luck for Catherine Tate and Russell Brand apologises for a joke he made. It's got to be the Showbiz Hot Five. At five, now you know those really, really annoying songs you hear on the radio. Well, what they've done is they've compiled a list to find out the most played song in the UK over the last five years. And the winner is Daniel Powter with Bad Day. Now, that horrific track was at the top with Kelly Clarkson's Because of You in second place. And surprise, surprise, James Blunt's You're Beautiful at number three. I can hear it now. James Blunt. Now, why does that not surprise me that he's in the top five most played songs? At Four Arctic Monkeys, producer James Ford's been talking about the band's new album. Now, it was announced earlier this week that the band had headed back into the studio to work on their third release. Now, their producer, who's also behind lots of the Claxons' work, the Monkeys' last album, and he fronts his own band, Simeon Mobile Disco, says he thinks the sound's going to be a bit more psychedelic. At three, Russell Brands apologised for prank calling the police during a live stand-up show. Now, he dialed the Northamptonshire force, claiming to have information about a series of local assaults. The comedian's been criticised by a rape charity and now says he's devastated he may have offended vulnerable people. At two, Dolly Parton's written the songs for a new musical based on her hit film, Nine to Five. The country star won an Oscar nomination for writing the title track in the 80s film, which she also starred in. The musical, about three colleagues who plot to turn the tables on their sexist boss, includes Dolly's original score, as well as 20 new songs. It's set to open in New York next April. And at one, now in Theatreland, they say, break a leg. Well, how's about an ankle? Catherine Tate's had to cancel the first public performance of her new play. Now, the comedy start was in the middle of a final dress rehearsal for Under the Blue Sky when she hurt her ankle. The Doctor Who actress was last seen on the London stage in 2005 alongside David Schwimmer in the play Some Girls.